This is video 47 in the Powder Actor mobile app series. It's called the Delay Video Effect. I want to give a proper shout out to why it came to my attention. And there was a video uh, that came up on YouTube earlier on today called the Create a Freeze Frame Clone Effect. Now, I don't really want to play much of it, but what I want to do is say that if you go and have a look at it, this is kind of the effect where the girl's jumping and there's four of her cloned. The point of it is that what they actually did, and I just want to get this to the uh, right level to show you on here, and that is I suggest you go and watch it as well, and that is that they put a video effect in and this is just showing you a tiny, tiny bit when it comes in. I'm just going to do this. This isn't getting away from anything, isn't it? It's avatar delay. That's the video effect that they put in. And I thought, hmm, why are they using a delay effect? And it, it makes it go like that. And that's what I want to show you right now on my version. And I say my version on my you know, app. So in, so in other words, what you've got here is this. If you take a delay effect with a still video recording it happens quite nicely let me show you the effect so this is just a regular english street shall we say let's bring that back and then play it watch so what we find are the cars that are, are actually moving look but they are and they are moving and are flying through there a bit like that so what actually happens is it's better if i stop this because i think my phone's taking a bit of memory here so what i find is that if you go through you actually get there's the car there look as it comes through because this is the delay video effect it's actually got sort of a ghosty sort of shadowing which is pretty cool and that is useful I'll show you another one when it comes down to this effect and that is that you go through and you can you see the way the cars are actually ghosting through I'll show you it comes through like that if you go to full screen because I've got this recording on a tripod the car is the one that is moving but also the still stationary scene i.e. the you know the grass and the road of course is also ghosting but because it's stationary it appears that it's actually static which is you know um, I would say so it's a ghost video effect not actually a um, delay but doesn't matter I want to demonstrate for the fact that if you take something like this, which is just acorns on a tree, if you actually use that where I'm actually hand holding my mobile, it is nightmarish. And I'll show you what I mean when I say nightmarish in that it makes you dizzy and it is a really bad effect. Show you. But in can you see the way the um, see everything's moving? And so it starts to, to ghost around there without taking too much going on. Had I put the tripod down with the camera, then I would have only got one thing. I'm feeling sick. I'm going to stop that. So going back to um, the beginning, if I remember go in and I remove this effect and I take it away, no effect, I will show you what the actual clip looks like. Very, very uninteresting. Cars are moving very slowly. Sure, that sports car is going a bit quicker. OK, if I go back and put it back in again, of course, you you don't need to do anything. Midway clip look. Uh, that do. So if I go in and say mid clip, can you see without the delay? It's, you know, it's a little silvery car, silver car going through convertible. But of course, if we go back and we hit effect delay, that same frame, if I go back back one that same frame as it goes it was about midway wasn't it you can see more or less that it is actually ghosted I think I missed this and so that's um, putting the pun out to say that this is a delayed video using the delay video effect I think that's um, quite useful really now let's finish it there because at the end of the day it is a big shout out to the delay video effect.